I am here with, I don't know, these are my favorite people at Comic-Con every year. And they have sold a lot of issues of Entertainment Weekly, so I am incredibly grateful to them. The cast of True Blood, they are here, and I, I wanted to go down the line with each of you. Not only tell me your name, but tell me something about yourself that maybe nobody knows. Why don't we start with the new guy? Oh, Let's start with precious. Rob Kaczynski. <laughs> um, my name is Rob Kaczynski, and um, you're a ginger. I am a ginger. I think most people know that, and I think that most people know that colors match the cuffs on this show by now. Um, <laughs> and yes, the beautiful woman next door. I'm Rotina Wesley, Hi. and let's see, I can hit a ball in a batting cage at 70 miles per hour. Ooh, wow. Baseball, not softball. Wow. That's you seem so, you, you you seem so you refined, know. and yeah, oh, there you are. I do it to get out my aggression. <laughs> nice, <It's awesome>. nice. <laughs> um, I am Deborah Ann Wool, and I guess um, my alter ego is Mistress Pyrona from my Dungeons and Dragons group. Yes. I'm so, sorry. Wow, you I fit right in. in. Yeah, yeah. Comic Con. I am a fire genasi sword mage, and I'm pretty awesome. So I don't. Yes. <laughs> Mistress Pyrona kicks ass. And yes, um, Sorky. And I'm Anna Paquin. I have absolutely no idea what she was talking about. Um, I also, totally I, do. I love my my Comic Con brethren, um, but that is not a community I know anything about. Um, I couldn't hit a softball or a baseball if you paid me a million dollars. At a hundred miles, seventy out miles, or two miles. <laughs> so I find you very impressive, and I can't think of anything interesting to say. <laughs> so athletics was never a big part of no, your... No, just not bats and balls and things. Oh, okay. Oh, she's athletic. She's a runner. Mm -hmm. I'm a runner and a boxer and a gymnast, but I, I don't do things with... And a With hand-eye hand <laughs> coordination. Okay. Is there I anything... like to hit things. <laughs> that makes sense. That serves, <laughs> serves you well. It serves you well on True Blood. Yes. Right? Exactly. Ryan, what do we not know? Uh, <laughs> what do we not know by now? Of, uh, well, I love long walks on the beach. I love, <laughs> I love uh, Cabernet Sauvignon from the Santa Barbara region. And um, yeah, um, if there's anyone out there who's... No, <laughs> there's, there's quite a lot. I have a high arch in my foot. Uh, I, I too like to hit things, so I, I think that's uh, where the brother-sister yeah. bond yeah. really came from. So this this cast is actually known as a cast that gets along very well. It's known as a happy set. Yeah. And there aren't a whole lot of those. But, but when you're the <laughs> new guy... Shame. Well, I mean, there are. Some of them are. Some of them are. But when you're the new guy and you come in, and these, these they're nice and everybody gets along, but they have also been working together mm -hmm. for many, many years. What kind of, what, what do you do to get yourself to fit in and what do they do to either make you incredibly uncomfortable or comfortable? Well, I think Can that, I answer that? Yeah, we go take ahead. your clothes away from you. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, Which makes you uncomfortable and comfortable. Actually, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, that was a, after that happened, I was pretty much like, well, that's, that's that. True. There's nowhere else to really go, everybody's seen you naked. I'm sorry. And, and Anna said to me, she's in the beginning, she's like, you know, everyone gets naked in a show, if I'm doing it, you'll damn well do it. So like, <laughs> you guess what's so happening with Suki? What isn't happening with Suki? I mean, um, well, I found I found my friend Warlow. Oh. Yes. <laughs> who may or may not have saved my life from my parents and That was a big it, twist. That's a pretty yeah. big plot twist that, you know, I mean, how do you respond to that? It's like the person that you thought was you know, had ruined your entire life is standing there saying, I saved your life and let's have a really loud argument while you're in your underwear. <laughs> <laughs> True love. <laughs> yeah.